Okay, so one of the things we wanted to do is we always wanted, we wanted, we both have started uh, on our bourbon journey, if you would. Uh, so we are trying to work in bourbon in almost all of our episodes. Uh, and if we don't have the bourbon in the episode, we're going to put links in there that you'll be able to click on it and see what we think. Again, we are brand new uh, to drinking bourbon. So today what we're doing is we're doing a bib and tucker. This is a six-year-old, uh, 92 proof, and, oh, I'm sorry. Jen, you can speak. Jeez, I, I don't know what that means when you're just pointing to it. So this is a 92 proof um, uh, bourbon. It's actually a small batch bourbon, which means it's a blend, um, out of Tennessee. Uh, Dane? Yeah, it's a nice looking bottle. You pour it out, it's got a nice oranges uh, color. It's very mild. It, uh, you pour it out, it's got a nice vanilla nose, it's got some floral notes. Mm. Uh, we're going to pour it, we're just going to take a little swig and just see how it goes. Hopefully get some of it in the glass. Yeah. Like I said, orangey, you can smell the vanilla, you can smell a little bite. But not, as, no. not a lot of ethanol in mm. there. You know? Not too ethanol -y. What was that one we had? Uh, uh, the, uh, was, the Iron was, Smoke. Uh, I went up to visit <laughs> some family in upstate New York and went to Iron Smoke Distillery. Great time, a lot of fun. Really enjoyed the bourbon, but it did have a big ethanol it was, front end to it. It was gas. Yeah. That, the one that I had was a good, it was a good mixer. It was a good uh, mule beer. So, or mule beer. Mule yeah, bourbon. very, very mild, very approachable. Mm-hmm. You get the, you get a little, it's sweet. You do get a, a nice sweet taste out of it or nice sweet smell. Yeah, I'm not, get a little vanilla. Little yeah. Vanilla. Not overwhelmed by like the, you know, the caramel that you normally mm. get with bourbon. And again, this is out of Tennessee. So. I think Columbia, Tennessee. Yeah. So you're getting the, uh, probably getting some Dickel in there, mm. which I, I like Dickel. Dickel is an acquired taste. Uh, I like Dickel. Uh, have you ever had? Have you ever had George Dickel? Mm, I, over here, probably, but I was probably had a few before that, so I don't <laughs> recall. It, so there's a there's a minerally kind of kind of thing to it going on here. With a lot of people say that uh, Dickel has like uh, Flintstone vitamin kind of thing going on. I used to love those. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Eat too many though. Yeah, <laughs> they just don't have my Turns into rice Can we crispies. Drink this already? Are we talking about why I'm yeah. short because I ate too many Flintstone vitamins? Uh, so I'm shorter than you, I think. So. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's give it a little cheers. Cheers. Mm. Yeah, very mild. Very mild. Very mild. Do you get the Flintstoney thing on the end? I really don't. There's a little uh, back to it. I get it. Um, there's a little back, but it doesn't have a big bite. I like it. It's actually a good, it's a good sipping one, I think. You know? Definitely not a lot of bite to it. Mm -hmm. very, it's mild. very mild. Uh, I've read some reviews on it, said it's inoffensive, which I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but <laughs> I'll go with mild. Um, I like it. I think this is a good one, neat I, on the rocks. I, I mean, find you inoffensive most of the time, except with pepper. <laughs> I'm going to take that as a compliment. And noodles. Because... I think what? you find me offensive most of the time. <laughs> Pull the bottle back. Yeah. Inoffensive. Out inoffensive out of Ken, Ken is actually a com compliment. So. <laughs> Jeez, I had a lot going on there, but I was just going to leave it out. All right. So overall, what do you think? Keeper? Not a keeper? I think it's a keeper. I think it's a keeper. It's smooth. Um, like I said, you can drink it on the rocks. Mm -hmm. I, I'm enjoying this neat. I thought when we poured this, this was a heavy pour, but I'm enjoying it. I think I'm going to finish it. So. Um, I think it's look a at the legs it's on it. Yeah. It's nice. It's a plus. I For like a 92, one. 92 proof, it, it's very drinkable. How much you spent on this, Ken? Uh, $49.99 at our friends at Browdy's. Yeah. So again, this is a six year. They do make a 12 year. We don't have that. Uh, but I, to just sip on it on a nice, uh, cool afternoon like today. Yeah, watch some football. Jaguars are only down six to three against the Bills. So let's uh, sip on this and watch some football. <laughs> All right, man. Well, we can't sip it. We got, we got, we got, we got meatloaf. Yeah, you can do that. I want to watch some football. All right, I'll do the meatloaf. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.